This question looks complicated, but it's not hard. First, we are going to multiply the index 2 by the indices inside the bracket. Now, 3 has an index of 1. So, 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times negative 3 is negative 6. Now, let's move to the denominator. We copy the 6 over. 3 times negative 5 is negative 15. 3 times 2 is 6. 3 squared over 6, we get 3 over 2. Now, fraction means division. So we are going to find the difference between the indices. Now, for index number base x, we have 8 minus negative 15, which is 23. And for index number base y, it's negative 6 minus 6. And that gives us negative 12. And that can be written as 3x to the power of 23 over 2y to the power of 12. First, we are going to multiply the index negative 3 by the index inside the bracket. So let's copy the first part over. Now, 1, x, and y has an index of 1. So, negative 3 times 1 is negative 3. 1 to the power of negative 3 is 1. Why is that so? Now, let's look here. 1 to the power of negative 3 is 1 over 1 to the power of 3. 1 to the power of 3 is 1. So 1 over 1 is 1. And then we multiply negative 3 by 1. And we get x to the power of negative 3. Again, we multiply negative 3 by 1 here. And we get y to the power of negative 3. Next, we can cancel out the x to the power of negative 3. And then for y, since this is multiplication, we are going to add up the indices. So down there, we get y to the power of 3 plus negative 3. And we get y to the power of 0. Now, remember that any number to the power of 0, we get 1. So, the answer is 1 over 2. 